everybody, Zeal Lightning returns for another Let's Play. And don't be surprised, it's not actually for the GameCube. I'm uh, using a GameCube uh, Nintendo player. So, with the Game Boy, this is a game I've been waiting to do for a while now. Sonic Tails, Knuckle Shadow, and Sonic Battle for the GBA. This is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Sonic Battle is one of my favorite fighting games ever. And in my opinion, it's the best fighting game to have Sonic in it. I, I just wish that it, it, it was a missed opportunity for a sequel because there's two little characters. There's a lot of nitpicks I have with this game, but we'll get into that when we get into that. So, uh... Without any further ado, let's uh, see this opening sequence again. Let's start a file. Good. Has a lot of languages here and a lot of symbols. So we can put the name Zeo.l, which means Zeo Lightning. The name of the master. Yeah. So, with Sonic Battle, there's story mode. Options, battle record, mini games, training, challenge mode, and battle mode. Story mode is, of course, the main mode of the game. Battle mode is when you are uh, just playing for fun, or you can play against pe uh, friends of yours if you have a link cable. Challenge mode is where you uh, do the um, challenges of the game with every character and after each character's story I'll be doing challenge mode with that character. Training is where you get to see the character's uh, skills and practice some moves. There's no combos in this game but uh, still it'll be nice to know what you're actually doing so I advise going here first. Mini games when we unlock them after every uh, after you defeat every uh, uh, story chapter can only be played um, with friends, except for one particular minigame, and I'll show that one off. Battle record lets you see the record that uh, we've set for everything. We've only played this game for two minutes, and I haven't done a single damn thing. <laughs> and of course, we have the options where you could just change the language and you get a sound test. This game has pretty good music, honestly, and you can delete the save data as well. So without any further ado, we're going to start story mode. We're going to start the main uh, character of the story mode, Sonic the Hedgehog. Well, for this story, every character has their own story. Fight. Why don't you fight? Who knew Eggman could throw a punch? Shoot. Dang, you piece of junk. Give me back the Chaos Emerald you took. Grr, what a piece of junk. I just said that. That's it. I've already used your data to create a robot that does what I say. So I don't need you anymore. This is Emerald Town. The place where Sonic and his friends live. It looks like Eggman is up to no good with his another evil scheme once again. The story begins as Sonic finds a mysterious robot at Emerald Beach. So, Emerald Town is where all where, where apparently Sonic and his friends have uh, stayed. You can see this Tails workshop. It's got the Tails logo, and Tails has a house. I wonder if Sonic lives there. But yeah, basically, when you're moving around on the world map, you just uh, go to places, and then you see this little cursor here. When you see the cursor, that means yeah, that's the place you can go. So let's go to Emerald Beach. Man, I am so bored. Hmm? What's this? A robot? Are you all right? I wonder if it's busted. Look at all this dust. I wonder how long it's been here. Hey, are you all right? Hey, it's moving now. Need any help? Can you walk by yourself? Hey, you can't speak, eh? Well, it figures. Can't expect from much from old Eggman. Well, let's get you over to Tails first, so we can figure out how to help you. Show power. Or I shut oh oh they shut conquer oh oh huh? What did it say? Show it my power like this. <laughs> 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 
still Sonic shows off his power. As if Sonic the Hedgehog needed any more DBZ references. What? What? Whoa! I sh oh, not represent and become of all. What? What is? What's it saying? I wonder if this thing can even be fixed. I better take it to Tails before it blows up. Tails Workshop is north is is north of town. Follow me. <laughs> Looks like I arrived a little too late. I must have established a link already. But with Sonic? What a strange choice. Oh well. I won't stop the world's greatest thief, Rouge, from getting what she wants. So yeah, you can see here. Tail's house is north of town. Follow me, huh? Do I smell perfume? Well, Rouge was just here. So we go north, and we can go here to Tail's house. So this is Tails. Shadow! Huh? Sonic the Hedgehog. Sorry, but I don't have time to play with you now. Hey, can you hear me? Respond! No! You must have already established a link. Shadow! Hey, you! Speak! Won't listen to me, eh? In that case, I'll destroy you with my bare hands. Hey, stop that! Get out of my of the way and give me that robot. Now you have two answers here. What happens if you say yes is you think I'd just say simply say yes, did you? Th then I will destroy you too. And if you say no, and if I say no, then I will destroy you too. Yep, he basically gives the same response to both answers. But anyway, now we're going to be experiencing combat for the first time in this game. So let's do a little training. So basically, I'm going to pick Sonic. He's not going to do anything, and that's going to be the map we're going to be playing on. Let's start, to start the game. So this is how it goes. For Sonic, you have three moves where you can set your R. Your shot, your power, and your bomb. The bomb is known as set. So, this is how the game moves. Sonic moves particularly fast. Probably the second fastest character in the game, only to Shadow. You press the B button to attack with punches. The A button to jump. The L button to block, and if you hold it, you can uh, charge. You can recover health and charge your Ichi Ichi meter, I believe it's called. And while you're in this, if you hold the uh, left and right, you can uh, pan the camera around so you can check for people coming up close to you, so you're not taken by surprise. So because you're completely defenseless while of this, and if you press L twice, you can actually uh, change the uh, angle of the camera. So basically, your goal here is to defeat your opponent. You just wail on them until they're done. So you have your shot. Basically, you can ha you have one uh, one particular uh, format. You have a ground move and an aerial attack, and whatever the third option you have is uh, what you're going to be able to defend against. So since the first one I picked was a shot, it's a ground shot. And since the second one I picked is the uh, the power move, it's the, it, it uses in the air. If you press start, you can uh, leave the, uh, the, um, the fight. Now if I change the order, I do different attacks. The ground, the ground move is now the, the uh, power attack. And the air move is now the shot. And if I uh, set this here, I can use the set power to give me a bomb. And I, ha I still have, and I'm still using shot in the air. But now I'm th now I'm strong against power. So if anybody were to use a power attack against me, it wouldn't work. Depending on what you're uh, automatically defensive to, can often change the outcome of a battle, especially when the Ichiriku meter charges up. 
Now, let's go ahead and start our first battle. Alright, so let's start off. I'll just use a shot. And I think I'll use set instead of power. Ready? Go! You can see the lives on the bottom. This is a survival match. Basically, you just gotta defeat your opponent the amount of times that you have. The, the amount of lives that they have. That's one life down. You can see in the top hand, the top left corner is your uh, life bar. Ah. Just let him go there. What he's trying to do is he's trying to beat Emerald, so he'll either go after you or Emerald. If you press A in, A in the air, you can use a ballot attack. Basically, it's a good move to escape or pursue. In this case, it's Sonic's uh, standard air dash. If you press the forward twice, you do a dash. And Sonic does a little leap. And if you can see the little, if you can see the, the orange bar is your health bar, but the bar above it is your Ichiriku meter. When your Ichiriku meter is completely filled, then you use a you use a, either a power, if you use either a power, a shot, or a set, you can automatically kill your opponent. As you can see, when you use a heavy attack, which is this move, every character has one when you use it, your opponent can bounce off the wall. If you uh, click the B button or uh, forward at or di any direction afterwards, you can chase them in the air and use a pursuit attack. Ba basically, it slams them against the ground. And when you win, game set. Oh, what's this? Top kick. That's nice. And Shadow Run, that's a great one to start off with. Skill points have increased by two. Guys, still haven't regained my full power yet. Listen to me, whatever you do, don't let Dr. Eggman get a hold of the gizoid. I'll be back. Until then, take care of it, Sonic the Hedgehog. Hey, how's Eggman involved in this? It's funny because he thought, because he, he didn't he say earlier couldn't expect much from old Eggman. Now he's asking why he's involved? Sonic, are you okay? I thought I saw Shadow and what is that? A robot? Oh, I found this robot by the beach. This thing's about to fall apart. Can you fix it, Tails? Where are you going, Sonic? I spotted a bat that I'm a little too familiar with lurking around. Take this robot to the lab, Tails. What, Sonic? Man, he's always on the run. Oh well, I've got a job to do. Oh boy, let's head to the lab. Can you walk? You could still pick this one. A giant bat was flying around the beach. <laughs> uh, we all know who that is, but we'll see who this giant bat is next time. So this is the lightning over now. Catch you later, folks.